Hello everyone, this is Hacker. Welcome to the channel. Today is Sunday, October 4th. And here's a list of the daily challenges in Madame Lazar's location. Madame Lazar is going to be located as far as west as possible. Way over here in plain view. And the nearest fast travel is going to be Tumbleweed. Okay, so now on to the dailies. Let's see what they give us. We have uh, five bay blades picked. One bird shooting contest completed. Five bluegill caught. Two iguana skinned, five non player enemies trampled, five vanilla flowers picked, and one visited Van Horn. So, five Bay Belays picked. I'm going to show you the locations, the easiest the easiest possible location to get them. And it's going to be over here in Valentine. Just fast travel to Valentine and and go ahead and grab those Bay Belays in this area here. Uh, there's, I marked six of them for you. And that should be way more than nothing to get that challenge done. Okay, so. We got one bird, bird shooting contest completed. For that, you're gonna have to start your posse up and go posse versus and go to bird bird shooting contest. Uh, you have to have a posse member, of course, to, to complete this. And once you do that, challenge be completed. All right. Then we have five bluegills caught. You can catch bluegills just about anywhere, but I advise you. To go to this little pond right here in the Heartland Overflow, Heartland Overflow area, right there. And once you throw your line in, you'll catch nothing but bluegill. And then once you do that, challenge will be completed. My head guy's got a headache big time. Two iguana skin. I'll show you the locations. We're going back to the map. <laughs> you can catch iguanas over here, especially right in this area here of the of the islands here. Uh, plus, you, you can go over here to over here in Armadillo here. In this area from all the way down to the s you can find armadillos you can find armadillos over here in hennigan steed you can find them of course down the coastline here in this area over here in this little island here and they got a guana island uh, where was that guana islands over here you can find them all in this area around benedict point area and by the a new austin you can find some and of course right in this area here of tumbleweed all you do is catch two, skin them, and then that challenge will be completed. Then you need five non-player enemies trampled for that. You can make any NPC your enemy by just uh, pointing a gun at them. When they turn red, just run them over. Or you can do roadblocks, hideouts, and trample them there. Or you can go down to Del Lobo Land at Thieves Landing and run them over there. Once you run over and kill five non-player enemies, that, tra that challenge will be completed. Five vanilla follow Five vanilla flowers picked. I'll show you locations. Not too far where I'm at here. And they're going to be over here. You can catch one there. Off the edge of the water there. In this area. Somewhere around here. Get here. And over here. And once you pick five. That challenge will be completed. Pretty easy general today. And then uh, one visit to Van Horn. Just fast travel to Van Horn. And when you get there. That challenge will be completed. I'm glad they're easy. Because that dog drove me nuts yesterday. All right, so bounty hunting, you need two bounties brought in from West Elizabeth. Just West, West Elizabeth consists of Strawberry, Blackwater, and Rig Station. Once you complete two of those bounties and bring them in, that challenge will be completed. They need uh, three bounty targets brought in, period. So basically, just do bring in three bounties. And then once you do the third one, that challenge will be completed. Three eagle eyes used to track a bounty target. We had that one yesterday. If you do a number two dollar bounty, 90% of the time it's going to be a search and you could actually when you're searching for the clues you can actually use your eagle eye and you get it that way or you can just tag your bounty with a tracking arrow and track them that way use eagle eye and once you do three that challenge is completed one crypt special camp stew recipe completed we just had this yesterday uh, when you go to stew pot instead of creating the superior go above it and create the special like sand and egg warm a stew or something like that and once you do that challenge will be completed too good so to a distant buyer go up the crypts and select the distant delivery and do a two of them and then that challenge will be completed 10 small animal carcasses to donate to crypts i advise you to go over to blue water marsh and kill some frogs toads bats rats squirrels and just donate 10 and that challenge will be completed Three coins found, just open up a map of coins from Mad Nazar and go to those three locations. Or you can use the player interactive map, which I'll provide the link below. Two collectibles found with a metal detector. The easiest would probably be coins. Uh, just open up a map of coins, sometimes lost jury. And just go to those two locations and that challenge will be completed. Three lost jury found, open up that map of lost jury map from Mad Nazar or go to that player interactive map. 
And once you get to three, that challenge will be completed. And then Moonshiner, we got one completed special Moonshine recipe. Just go downstairs and create a three bat, three star batch of Moonshine. Uh, it, it, the three star batch consists of uh, a collectible. And once you do, and once Crips, I'm Crips. Once Marcel finished that batch, that challenge will be completed. Two hundred dollars money made from trading. I mean, from Moonshine sold. When your special is done, go ahead and deliver it. Be careful around corners, curves, uh, bridges, over the uh, railroads. Uh, revenueers and once and once you get there safely you know, you'll get that challenge done one moonshine bar change the core go up to maggie and go and then go to the moonshine store and change the decor or you can change your picture and then that challenge will be completed and in naturalist we got two blending tonics used or cra crafted or used you can get blending tonics and a pamphlet from harriet and just go ahead and craft two blending tonics or use just two blending tonics and that challenge will be completed Three forest river animal samples. I'll, I'll show you. I'll show you what we need here. Three forest river. Oh, what am I doing here? A weapon. Go to weapon wheel here, and then go over to here, and then go to go to the forest. I think I said yeah, forest. And you need bears, beavers, raccoons, foxes, skunks, possum, muskrats, mooses. I had you, the easiest would probably be the uh, jackrabbits or the muskrats. And go ahead and sedate those, and then that challenge be completed. I thought we had to revive them. I don't know. I can't remember. Let's see. We gotta just take the samples. And then, last but not least, the three mountain grassland animal samples taken. So once again, we're gonna go back to the guide here, mountain grassland, and what is this gonna consist of? Elk, badgers, wolves, rams, coyotes, deer, wild boar. Uh, bison and pronghorn. The easiest in this category probably be the coyotes because they're the most abundant and wild boars. And then once you once you take those samples, that challenge will be completed. And that's it, guys. Madam Lazar, once again, she's going to be lo located the farthest possible point of the west here. <laughs> Over here in, in Plainview and Rio Bravo. And then the nearest fast drive is going to be Tumbleweed, unless you bring your camp over here in Rio Bravo. Okay, guys, I wish everybody luck on their dailies. And later.